All right, welcome back everybody. Welcome back to the Two Stroke Turbo channel. Stella just got a little pat on the head. She's fine with a little love. What are we working on today? Look around, you see some bright col colored cars. This is a 914 Porsche, it's what we're working on. It's actually a customer's car. We're actually getting paid to work on a car now. We were working on, well, I shouldn't say that, some old Hondas. The red Honda I've been working on quite a bit, that's a customer car. The one with the blue hood, we got that all sort of reconnoitered, waiting for new headlights to arrive. Did a uh, power pull, what's that called? Power, port of power pull on the gold Honda there that's got the smashed T-bone side. Uh, I'm not so happy with this car, but um, I just can't seem to get the right angle on this, which is now flooded. You know the floorboards are good when they're holding water, but this rocker has really got me flustered. I might cut that out and put a different rocker in. I'm not sure. I'm not going to think about it right now. And then we've got another gold Honda here. And the tire has just split, and it's cutting the back of my leg as I walk by. The whole tread has peeled off. And now the hatch won't go down because one of the shocks are seized. So i got lots of gold Hondas to work on. But let's, let's get back to thing of the day. Oh, look, look who's here. Oh, and I think we have a visitor. Who do we have today? Hey, Jeremy, how are you? All right, man. You're the automotive artist. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, as a, um, it's an addictive uh, habit. It say. is. I, th I feel like I'm the last person, that, you know, that's really bringing it all together. Because <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm not your typical one exposure artist. I'm a multi exposure artist. Multi exposure Jeez, artist. There's like probably 20 to 15 hours that goes into each piece. I can't oh. really sell my originals. And did you bring a piece today? I did. You did. Let's For take you, a look yes. at it. Yes. That's a very oh. rare one. This is a. It's a crime scene uh, in action. Crime scene yeah. in yeah. action. Yeah, a, oh. Anyways, what do we got? So. This is okay. Stella's yep. gonna sniff you out. Oh, let's. There we are. Oh, wow. Whoa, okay. look at the detail in that thing. Wow, that's yeah. fantastic. I'm on the right, my brother's on the left. So you're on the right. Let's zoom in on the on the face there. Yeah, it looks just like you. <laughs> and there's your brother on the left. And yeah. we've got, oh, look what at this. What does it say? So, um, smoke and weed keeps me alive. My alien bloodline will survive. Oh, yeah. And then your brother says, getting high is what I need. Now stealing my bags of weed. And this is, aliens are fast and furious. Humans are slow and curious. Yeah. That's very creative. <laughs> Thank you. And uh, the feature car in this one, even though there's a, uh, a second appearance, the feature car is a 59 Cadillac X four door, now micro car. Yeah, that's this one right back here. Yep. It's the it's the front one. Oh, the front right. I was right. Right. The front with one. The green, one in the green, back. Green headliner. That's okay. Yep. yep. The one in the back with the purple headliner, which I might change. Yep. Is a is my old forty eight Cadillac hearse, shortened up. Shortened up. Yep. Oh wow. And then uh, I've got uh, my dog down there, which is no longer with me. I decided to install him. Yes, I see that. He's chewing on the the rocking horse. Yep. 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 Wow, and is that you or your brother shooting the... Uh, the... Uh, that's uh, just some guy some on guy. the internet. I don't know. That is so Whoever great. it is, he gets credit. <laughs> <laughs> so if someone wants to find more of your artwork, how would they get a hold of you? What would they uh, do? Just email, I guess. And I email. guess this is this is the email address. Okay, your, fi your fingers are covering up oh. part of it there. Yeah, sorry. There you go. Right. So that's ja.luge at gmail.com. <laughs> yeah, that's right. That's how people can find you. Yeah. All right, well, thanks for coming in today, Jeremy. Thanks hey, for welcome. the gift. That's awesome. And I'll just go ahead and leave this with you somewhere. I don't know where. <laughs> <laughs> we'll find a spot. I'll just leave the whole thing with you. <laughs> that All sounds right, good. Mark. All right, we'll see you. Okay, so we had a little bit of a commercial break there. Let's come on in the shop. What are we working on today? Oh, I think I might have alluded to it a little earlier. This bright orange 914 Porsche. Let's see. Whoa. We got the gas tank out. We got the heater boxes out. We had to get the wiper motor out because the wipers didn't work and it's the middle of November. And if you live in Oregon, you need wipers. So what is it about these things? This is the wiper motor and uh, assembly that has the, the rods on it. I've disconnected 
the actuating rod from the wiper motor, which is right here. And I have found that the complete wiper motor assembly is seized and probably why the wiper motor is bad. And that's because the car sat for 30 years. So I am trying to lubricate all these joints. I may put some heat on these studs. I think they're stuck right down in here. Let's see if I can get this freed up. Would you believe that a 914 Porsche wiper motor like this, like this assembly right here, used, untested, is $500. If you want a new motor, just the motor, not rebuilt, but new, because nobody seems to rebuild them, it's $1,000. It is nuts. I had no idea. So this motor is seized. I got a used motor off eBay, and I didn't realize that the wiper linkage assembly would be seized. I've got the wiper motor in the car, and it's wired up, and we're gonna see if it actually works. Supposedly that is a good used motor. And we're gonna turn the key on. And turn the wiper switch on. And I can hear something buzzing. Oh yeah. You can see that's turning. Now the difference between a 74 914 and a 75 is that the 75 has intermittent wipers. So there's one more position on this switch. That should be high speed and I heard the motor turn off. Low speed, off. And let's see if it, yeah, it returns. Okay, that's good. I don't wanna run the fuel pump too long because it's dry. Well, we at least have a wiper motor that works. That's where we are today. Now we gotta get the linkage working, the wiper motor and the linkage back in the car. I've gotta get all the duct work, the heater fan, and the windshield washers all back in order. That's gonna take a while, so wish me luck. I am not sure how I'm gonna get this freed up, but I'm gonna try very carefully to persuade this wiper linkage assembly to come back to life. It's part of having old cars, but this one's worth it. It's really a cool car. It's been off the road, I think I told you in another video, since 1996. That is almost 30 years. 30 years of persuading this old girl back to life. Okay, so I got the wiper motor off. Got a little torch here. I'm gonna heat up these pins or pivot points. I'm pretty sure that's where they're stuck. I did squirt a little penetrating oil in the top there. You can see it bubbling. Maybe not. Smoking a little bit. Let's see if we can get this thing to free up. I don't want to spend a thousand dollars on a wiper linkage motor or wiper linkage for the motor. Okay, it's a little bit of heat because there's some rubber bushings there. Let's turn that off. And then we're going to take our screwdriver. Let's see if we can pry a little bit. Oh, it's moving. Look at that. Okay, we just got to get it to go full circle. Full sweep, I should say. Yes, we got something. That wasn't too bad. See that moving? Okay, that's how we're gonna fix this thing. We're gonna make this guy really happy. So we're gonna grab hold of the cross shaft here and we're gonna work it back and forth. Oh boy, it's really stuck. Try not to burn ourselves on the hot pieces. Oh, it's really stuck. I think we need to use a screwdriver again. Oh. Okay, and after a generous amount of PB Blaster, we can get some to come out of there. There we go. Create a little smoke. Wick that down in there. It's coming out slow. Yeah, we got something. We have a nice free linkage. Okay, now we can put it back together. That's so much better.